I won't sugarcoat this when I say that it made me absolutely sick to my stomach when I first saw this bridge and pictured the girls walking across here late at night. Why would Elizabeth and Jennifer feel comfortable going this way? It's been a question that's always bothered me ever since I first learned about this case. And then I did some more research and I came across something very interesting. According to what's been reported, it was Jennifer Ertman that wanted to go this way and not Elizabeth Pena. Elizabeth actually lived fairly close to the park. However, Jennifer lived about five or six miles away from here. So you have to ask yourself, how is it possible that she would have the knowledge of the shortcut? She didn't live with an easy walking distance of this park, yet she felt comfortable enough to suggest that they go this way back to Elizabeth's house. She even knew about the loose fence 